Another small update today, so small in fact that I only felt justified in making this video because I bothered to upscale the fridge GIF. JPEG. NASA. Link to the upscaled version in the description. The big news is Anubis's new entrance to B-Site. It's all been shifted around and feels a lot more open and a bit less scary to rush. There just seem to be fewer places you need to check, no matter where you're stood. Which I prefer. This section is now a lot shorter, which means that terrorists will reach the site quite a bit sooner. But this might not change the balance as much as you might think, since it seems like the CT spawns have also been shifted up to the top platform. An unintended side effect of this will be on bombsite A, but further testing will be needed to know the specifics. But I feel like it will take less time for the teams to meet each other now, leading to conflict sooner in each round. Back to the B changes, it's affected almost every sightline imaginable. I'm talking here to give you time to look at these before and after comparisons, but you'll really have to boot it up and play it for yourself to know the specifics of how it will change the site's balance. The texture streaming will now be less blobby by loading certain textures in at full resolution, unless a lower quality version has been intentionally made. My thorough testing of this involved booting up the benchmark map and seeing if it looked blobby at the very start of it, and it did still look blobby. And so did one of the hieroglyphs on Anubis, which popped in as I spawned as a CT. Hmm. I wouldn't get too excited unless you're gaming on a calculator from 1995. I thought the patch note for chlorine looked familiar. In early April it got the same fix, something to do with the glowy eyes at bombsite B not being included. When you plant the bomb at B, they're supposed to light up like this, which they now do again. And last are a number of small fixes to Anubis. Trying to find such trivial things would normally give me hours of fun, but there was no need to do this since the fixes mostly seem to be in response to suggestions on the workshop page from members of the community. Z fighting's a fun problem. It's when there are two textures in the same place and the game doesn't know which one to show, so it instead tries to show both, flickering violently. That might have been the case with some of the props and surfaces on this map, but Luminotius showed it happen to the props on this wall in A when the place had been molotoved. It still happens a bit, but you have to be further away, and it's a bit less noticeable. Henty deserves special mention here. He has been posting all sorts of bugs and suggestions over on Anubis's original workshop page. He pointed out that water could be seen down the side of this prop just outside of A, which has been fixed. The clipping around this corner near T-spawn has been made more reliable. An upside down table you used to be able to stand on has been taken away, and you can now stand around the base of the tree, should you really want to. The transitions between props can sometimes be abrupt, as is the case in this corner here. I don't think there's any easy fix to this, so a light has simply been placed in front of it to try and brighten everything up. This prop also used to be too dark, but now appears to be lit correctly. Probably a remnant from an older map. There were some irrelevant clip brushes here in middle which have been taken away, which should smooth movement around this corner. And as can be seen from this picture, it used to be very hard to spot CTs stood here in water. So it's been simplified and brightened to help matters. This stack of stuff has been made even bigger so people don't think they can boost up onto it. This box in middle used to partially stick through a wall. Oh no. So it's been shifted out ever so slightly. As was so kindly pointed out to me on Reddit, the graffiti appears to predate the hieroglyphics. If you want the upscaled 60fps fridge GIF, then you can find it linked to in the video's description. JFEG. Nessa.